In this video, we're going to be taking a look at the old Helium Miners, the one that only does IoT, that was released before they even announced 5G mobile mining. And we're going to see, is it still worth it to have one of these plugged in in 2024? Now for this particular test, we are going to be testing a lone wolf, which means this is the only IoT device in the entire area and it cannot ping other Helium hotspots. So the rewards are expected to be low, but there are still other devices out there, such as the Invoxia Tracker or the new Macron for Demo. So it's still very important for the People's Network to run IoT. And my solution would be to actually do both. So if you go to Cowchip's website, you can actually buy a Freedom Fi where the black part is for IoT and the white part is the radio portion that is for 5G. I also have a video of me setting that one up actually if you would like to take a look at that and also a quick shout out to my sponsor cosmic equipment where you can buy different d pin devices or you can actually host for them just by emailing them and hosting is actually a great option because you don't have to pay for the unit but you do have to give up a portion of the rewards to cosmic equipment because they own it if you decide to email them and host them know that matlong6 sent you or if you want to buy your own deep end device from their website then use code matlong6 to get 10 pounds off your order and now another thing before we set this thing up is we're going to be not only upgrading this but if you would like to know how much this and my mobile helium hotspots are doing or any of my deep end devices once a month on the first saturday of the month we do a monthly live stream where we just talk about crypto and i share how much money all these different deep end devices make me right now you may see that i'm standing here you're like why am i next to my doorway and stuff that's because we're going in the attic today because i'm going to install my iot miner in the attic you know i have a 5g miner here's an iot miner and then my freedom fi that does both is in a different house in this video i'm actually going to be upgrading the antenna instead of this default antenna that it comes with it i am going to be upgrading the antenna to a 5.8 dbi now if you would like to upgrade your antenna it may depend on whether or not it's worth it after watching this video if we think iot is still worth mining I have this leftover from previous videos I made way in the past. Go check it out. I have lots of videos about how to upgrade and stuff if you're interested. You could also consider going to Cosmic Equipment and take a look at the ones that they have there and a ton of other deep end projects. Anyways, we are going to go into the attic. The first thing I want to let you guys know is that I installed a light. So that will make everything easier. And we have a way to plug it in right here. This took me about four hours. Um, yes, to put in a service light. I have a few other things that I ran electric to as well when I was up here. So I didn't just spend four hours doing only this. Anyways, our goal is to not fall today. And I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna install the shelf to hold the hotspot. And then we're just gonna see how much um makes next month now i did run a test and using the normal antenna nets me about 10 iot a month is like one cent so it's not looking good um we're going to take a look and see if uh upgrading it matters or not and the first thing i noticed is that i'm going to have to bring the shelf down lower than i thought yeah and i have really thick walls so maybe i even should put it down here where it's not as thick i'm not sure but we're going to figure this all out and put this up right now i almost dropped it Just had to go get my level. <laughs> what I need to do now is put the new hotspot in. So let me show you how this is going to work. This is going to sit here and plug into the wall. And then from that, it's going to plug into this, which is a mount. It's actually magnetic. You can put it on something magnetic. It's really cool. 
and then you take this antenna which is a better antenna but you need to watch my video on that explains the antennas in dbi a little bit more and then you just screw that on here and now this should broadcast further the iot and if it makes money or not I'm helping the IoT network and I'm providing some range. So maybe someone has a dog collar that works on helium. The dog runs by this hotspot and now it's pinged. So someone will know where their dog was. There's nothing here. So that means I'm literally the only hope of anyone getting any type of ping from helium. Now do keep in mind guys that if you end up upgrading yourself you will need to upgrade how much dbi your hotspot is doing and i have a video on how to do that it's very confusing here in 2024 on how to work an old helium hotspot but let me know if you have any questions about old helium hotspots um, or just get a new one <laughs> And if uh, you can't get your hands on one of these magnetic bases, that's fine. They give you uh, a different bracking mechanism. You can bracket it to the wall or something. Just make sure it's plumb and level and you should be good. So I already have done absolutely everything I need to do on the app. I did that before I started the video. Um, and I also changed the location and everything. Um, the DBI is updated on the antenna. All I literally need to do is plug it in and wait for my rewards to come in. So the next part of the video, I'm just gonna quickly show you how much money I actually made with this um, to let you guys know if it's worth it. So thank you guys so much for watching this video and leaving a like since I highly doubt this is gonna make any money as a lone wolf in the middle of nowhere. All right, let's cut through that segment now. Okay guys, now's the time to finally see how much money I actually made with one month of mining IoT in my attic. Drum roll, please. We made five IoT. Five, I, you can't even see it. Five IoT, you see that? The top one's five OT. The bottom one is how much money I made with 5G and IoT and a bigger area, but in a really small place where I am, it's, there's nothing. There's nothing. We're not making any money. I made one cent worth. This five IOT is worth one cent. So no, it is not worth mining a as a lone wolf. Now, if there's other ones around you, it's still possible because I'm still making 5,000 IOT um, when I'm around other um, IOT helium devices, but not when it's only a lone wolf. So now the question has been answered. Let me know in the comments down below what you've learned. Be sure to join my monthly live streams. Thank you for watching. And as always, guys, trade safe, watch out for scams, and God bless. Peace.